Yo, what is going on everybody? My name is Connor, but you guys can call me Spear. Today, bringing you guys episode 2 of DNA Bomb with every single weapon in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. And in episode 2, we're going to be doing the AK-12. Now, I am starting out with the easy ones. If you notice, episode 1 was the BAL, uh, which at the time I got that gameplay was the best gun in the game by far. And now we're doing the AK-12, uh, which is probably the second best gun in the game. And um, I'm kind of going to just get the, like, the, the boring ones out of the way real quick, because I honestly, like, going for these DNA bombs with these weapons took like literally like four games and boom I had all the assault rifles done so uh, minus the MK14 that was a pain but I'm gonna be getting easy ones out of the way first and then we can get into the interesting ones like some of the submachine guns like the dual submachine guns the LMGs will be pretty hard um, the laser gun we can get into all the fun ones um, you know as soon as we get uh, the little bit more boring ones like the AK-12 out of the way so uh, with that being said this gameplay is pretty sweet it is playing on the map comeback now the AK-12 I was using in this gameplay was the AK-12G and the way you get the AK-12G is I'm pretty sure you got it for like pre-ordering the game and all it is is the G stands for Ghost so it's the AK-12 from Call of Duty Ghost um, you know you notice that the AK-12 in this game is a little bit different of an iron sight on it uh, it has a little like circle thing at the end and this one it is literally the exact AK-12 you know same iron sight it even has a little ghost logo uh, on the back of it to just further like prove it was from ghost so I was using it just because I like this one a little bit better I'm more used to it just because it was in ghost and I use this gun a lot more in ghost than I have in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare so I'm um, kind of like that familiarity or I don't know, it kind of having that familiar feeling to me is why I picked this one over the Call of Duty Advanced Warfare one. Even though it is like the same stats and pretty much the same gun, uh, it's just like the aesthetics of it that look uh, just a little bit different. But really quickly, I just wanted to thank you guys for 21,000 subscribers. Uh, we're really getting up there, and hopefully in Advanced Warfare, we can hit like 50,000, maybe even 75,000 subscribers uh, at the rate we're growing right now. So big shout out to you guys for showing all the support. I appreciate it. Um... One more thing, I think a lot of you guys don't know this, um, I am doing the DNA bomb with every single gun live over on my Twitch.tv, I'll leave the link down in the description, um, pretty much I stream every single day from about 3.30 Central Standard Time to about 8.30 to 9.30 Central Standard Time, and all I do is go for gameplays, you know, I sit there, I talk to the chat, and I talk to you guys, um, I just kind of interact while I try my absolute heart out and try and get DNA bombs or 100 plus kills or whatever, so it's a lot of fun, and I'm um, assuming a lot of you guys are actually from my Twitch channel, and just big thank you to all you guys for all the support you guys have been showing, um, you know, it really means the world to me, I've put in so much work into this YouTube and Twitch thing for so long now, um, that it's awesome to see it, like, paying off now, and you guys enjoying the content and everything like that, so, uh, with that being said, if we could go for 300 likes on this video, I think I've had one video in the past like week get like 400 likes, which was absolutely ridiculous. So if everyone could just hit the like button, it'd be really mean the world to me if we could hit that 300 likes. So I do hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Go ahead and drop a comment down below on what assault rifle I should do in the next episode. I do have all the assault rifles done, most of the submachine guns, um, one of the light machine guns. I think I, I know I have one of the snipers done. I just have to find where I got that in the in my recordings and then the pistols are going to be a pain so i'm looking forward to this series but at the same time i'm kind of dreading it so i do hope you guys enjoyed this video go ahead and subscribe for more advanced warfare content leave a like if you guys did enjoy and i'll see you guys in another video peace out